don't know about this, Kevin. Look, Angie, he doesn't yell at you like the rest of us. Calvin's two seconds away from a nervous breakdown. Ivan's on thin ice. And I can't say anything. If I say one more thing out of term, my ass is grass. Angie, if you say something, maybe he'll listen to you. I guess, but what Angie! Is... It's the best chance we have to get through to him. But Kevin, he barely acknowledges my existence. Why can't we just talk to Brooke? I mean, she is the stage manager after all. Oh, what a great idea. Let's, come on, let's go talk to Brooke, the rational stage manager. Come on, Angie, think. Brooke is essentially his mini-me. What good would that do? I guess you're right. I mean, he is just the theater director. And I know he can be a bit out there, but how scary can he be? Shut it, piss ant. All right, shit birds. We've got a lot to do today, so I don't want to hear any bitching or moaning about the changes I've made to the script. All right? If you've got a problem, you can take it up with the complaint department. You have to do this now. I, I will. I'm just waiting for an opening. You know how he gets about being interrupted. Excuse me? Is this the club about whispering about your pathetic little love lives? Or maybe the club for trading acne treatments. Ha, that's funny, you know, because last time I saw, it was the Middle Grove High School fucking theater department. No, 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 uh, uh, Angie wants to tell you something. Well, let's hear it then, Angie. Well, we've all been talking and the changes to the script don't make much sense. Like, why are the characters stargazing during the day? It's all pretty confusing. Oh, I see. Um, Angie, could you and I have a, a word over here? <laughs> you are a self-righteous bitch, all right? That is the most embarrassing thing to have happened to me. Who the hell do you think you are, all right? Who are you to question my writing? I'll let you know I have been rejected from Juilliard for being, quote, too unhinged. I've scrounged through every penny I've had, and I've done a lot of shit that I am not proud of, all right? I've been banned in eight different states, including Ohio and our local Olive Garden. Hell, I even killed a man. Do you want to know why? What? Just to play God. You are nothing, Angie Elizabeth Parker. I don't want to see your face. I don't want to hear your voice. I don't even want to sense your presence. If I do, I'll throw you out the goddamn window. Vice Principal Evans. Uh, uh, let's take 20, everyone. <laughs>